Mali reached its golden age under the great and renowned Mansa Kanka Mansa. The achievement of his reign continued under his successors, most especially Mansa Slima. But after Slima, the empire begins to decline. By the second half of the 14th century, the great empire has shrunk in size and reverted to, to the original kingdom of Kangaba. In 1473, Sane Ali of Songhai captures Jenna and annexed a great part of Mali to the emergent Songhai Empire. Let's take a look on why and how the second great Negro Empire of Western Sudan ended. happens, a great empire crumbles as a result of bad and incompetent rulers that dragged the empire down into robbers. So was the case of Mali Empire. Mansa Magan, who ruled from 1337 to 1341, succeeded his father Mansa Musa and set the stage for the decline of Mali Empire. His inefficiency made it possible for the Gaon princes Ali Kolin and Suleiman Nair to escape captivity back to Gaon. There, they organized a successful revolt and drove out Mali's forces stationed in Gao since the reign of Mansa Kanka Musa. From then, the Songhai kingdom of Gao became a serious threat to Mali imperial supremacy in the Western Sudan. Succession disputes became frequent in the empire. The empire passed through a period of 40 years of incessant civil wars and frequent changes of emperors. As a result of this, many Fasa states seized the opportunity to revolt and regain their independence. Another reason was that Mali had grown too extensive for effective control by the central government. The army which the stability of the empire depended on had been weakened by civil wars, resulting from dynastic disputes. Consequently, Mali could no longer quell the revolt or bring back rebel Fasa states. Mali's trade, upon which the economy of the empire depended on, also suffered a serious impact owing to the civil wars and internal strife. Because of the internal weaknesses and disorder in Mali, external enemies began to assault the frontiers of the empire from all directions. Having regained independence, in 1375, Songhai Kingdom began to make steady incursion into the Mali Empire. The torrents of the desert attacked and captured Walata and Timbuktu in 1433. The Mossi raided the southern frontier and also sacked Timbuktu. The Tukolo and Wolof from the west seized the opportunity to regain their independence. The weak Mali emperors appealed to the help of the Portuguese at Argon and Elmina. The Portuguese did not respond to Mali's appeal because they obviously were more interested in the slaves than the world produced for them. The disintegration of the empire continued and by 1468, the Songhai under Ali had started capturing parts of the Mali empire. And by the end of the 15th century, much of what remained of Mali had been annexed to the Songhai Empire. In the 17th century, the Bambara of Segu and Kata built their kingdom on the ruins of the defunct Mali Empire. By 1670, Mali had disappeared from the map of the time. That was the end of the great and illustrious empire of Mali. Thank you for watching this video. Don't forget to like and subscribe to this channel. Thanks again. Peace.